What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Kia. Um, today is December the 27th, the holidays. Well, Christmas is officially over. Thank God. Christmas used to be like one of my favorite holidays until I turned into Santa and baby, I don't know. I stress too much about it and I don't like that. I don't like for my anxiety to be acting crazy. But anyway, um, today is the 27th. I finally launched my digital planner that I have been working on for eh, almost a little over a month. And y'all, when I tell y'all I did all, everything, the links, the um like the background like the little let me show y'all just to show y'all because baby that was some hard work and baby the people baby y'all loving it um let me see let's show y'all what it's called good notes okay here we go so like all of this like you know, the flower on top of that, like that right there. <laughs> like, yes, all the little stuff. This sticker right here, I put that there. Like, this, that. Um, hold on. Because it's the most stuff, too. Like, all the little stuff. Like, I did that. I And it probably, it, like, these two ladies, at first I had just a white lady. I'm like, what a black lady at? I'm like, you know, like, so I had to go back and find her. Um... Like, this is one of my favorite pages, the Journal Thoughts and Diary. This is a safe place. Let it out with her. Like, baby, we get it. We get it. I feel like um, we just, first of all, us as black women, we just so taught to be so strong, independent, and hold it in. And people wonder why we angry. No, baby, let that out. Let that anger go. If you need to let it out, let it out. So I really love that page. Um, I really love the fact that, I just love everything about the planet. I love the fact that y'all love it. Because I know I always be like, you know, when it's your time, it's your time. But honestly, like realistically, you hate to have worked so hard just for it to be a flop. Even though it happens. But I'm so glad that y'all are loving the planner. Like that just really melts my heart. And I'm glad y'all love it because I have something else in store that I basically want to see how this planner was going to do before I worked on my next project. Like, I just feel like this is, this is, this is, this for me. This is for me. But anyway, um, I'm once again happy that y'all liked it. Um, the first page should be filled out before New Year's Eve, which is the page that's, I know, I think that's like the second or third page. It's the 2024 vision board where you basically, it's just like, it's a digital vision board, basically. Uh, I'm most definitely going to work on mine. Yeah, I just came back from my mama house. I'm so pissed off that she threw away the Christmas food. Baby, you didn't even let me get a chance to go to the grocery store. I was planning on eating that for the rest of the week. But she threw it all away. So I'm about to make me something to eat. And then I have to edit some TikToks. Um, I have to edit some TikToks. What else do I have to do? I don't know. Like, I'm just, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy about my planner. I guess because, like I told y'all in the last vlog, like I was trying to take the easy way out, trying to pay somebody to do it, trying to like, I was trying to do all of that. And at the end of the day, I end up doing everything on my own. And it's just like, I'm proud of the outcome so far. Um, What else? Yeah, one thing about my baby, she is so creative. Babe, put them on. She made these glasses. These I sunglasses. made them at my nana house, but they didn't work, so I added some extension. Yeah, turn to the side. Yeah. Yeah, that was very good. Slay. Go. Go with your sister. Go ahead. Charlie, come on. We're going downstairs. Okay, so y'all, real quick before I go to sleep, I just wanted to tell y'all what happened to me yesterday. So, I went to, um, so I was in my bed, laying down, relaxing. Now, this was the day after Christmas. 
So, you know, my daughter got a little cash. Why my sh So, my daughter got a little cash. Um, and she was just so grateful, so appreciative about her room. So, she like, Ma, I want to take you to IHOP because, you know, I'm grateful. I just want to, you know, take you out. Right? So, we get to IHOP. So, I order a strawberry lemonade and she ordered regular lemonade. So, she tried to dig her hand in my drink and take my strawberries out of my lemonade. So, I'm like, no. Get your hand on my drink. So, she's like, don't worry about it. I ain't paying for your food. Now, if y'all know Kaylee, y'all know that's that's the normal for her. Kaylee is a petty ass baby. Like, that's that's something that Kaylee would do. So, I'm like, really, Kay? Do y'all know this baby really did not pay for my food? Like, now, my thing is this. You took me because you was grateful for everything that I did for you. So for you to take it right back because I didn't let you dig your nasty fingers in my drink is crazy. Secondly, what if I like genuinely didn't have any money because I spent it all on Christmas, bills, like, what if I didn't have no money? Like, so she did not pay for my food and I'm just trying to figure out like, how should I go about this? Like... Because I want my lick back. I want my lick back bad. And because it's just like, it's the principle. You don't do people like that. And Kaylee always do stuff to me like that. And I always just give, give, give. But no, this time, she's going to have to pay. For oh, let me go get my iPad from her. Don't worry about it. Y'all, it is... What's today, Kay? Um, Thursday. It's Thursday night. It's Thursday at 7.51 p.m. Y'all know my little sister Raven is up here from school and she's been stalking me. Literally stalking. I look blurry. Literally stalking me about some seafood. So I just came from Sam's Club. Okay, y'all. So I got some snow crab, some king crab, and I got some lobster tails. And I make mine real easy. I put my um I make mine real easy. I throw it in the oven, put some butter, some seasoning on top of it. Bam, it's done. Today is December the 29th. Um, it's like 11 o'clock. I did get a late start, but I'm woke nevertheless. And y'all already know what time it is. It's time to get your house together for the new year. You gotta, y'all, I ain't even gotta tell you everything that you gotta do. You know, you gotta clean, do laundry, <laughs> get you some beans, all of that. So I'm up getting my space together and y'all why do i have so much laundry like i feel like i have a washer and dryer at home so there's no reason why i should let my laundry pile up once upon a time i did start saying that i was going to wash like every sunday but i feel like when sunday came i just didn't have enough to wash like it didn't make sense to wash so when i tried doing it every two weeks it was starting to be a little bit too much so i'd rather not have too much to wash and wash could get it done easier so after I wash all these clothes, your girl is back washing every Sunday. Um, I'm about to give Charlie a bath. But anyway, I'm trying to get everything done, complete, out the way. Yeah, we're going to get it together. I hope y'all getting it together, too. And then um, I put on Instagram that if you have the digital planner, the 2024 vision board part should be done before the 1st of January. Like, that's y'all first task. To, and I'm, I haven't did mine yet, either. <laughs> 
but I'm doing I'll probably do mad tomorrow um I probably do mad tomorrow because I do want to go to like a different like a coffee shop or something so I can really just because I feel like I lay in my bed a lot to do my work and I just feel like I'd be more effective more productive if I go somewhere else I could just go to my office but I don't know. I want to go to a coffee shop. Also, I want to go to a coffee shop because I want to get some content done with the digital planner. And if you purchase the digital planner, let me know how y'all feel about it. I want y'all honest opinion. And I really do need y'all honest opinion if y'all love, if y'all got criticism because I got something else coming and I'm going to need your help with that. Um, well, I'm not going to tell y'all because y'all have my girls anyway. But the next one I have coming, and it was inspired from my little sister, my teenage little sister. And it just made me think about, you know, my teen years, how unorganized I was, how, you know, like, it's just a lot. So I want my next digital planner to be focused mostly on from 13 to, like, 21, from high school to college. So it's going to be, you know, it's going to be pretty much, it's going to have a lot of the same things that man got. But it's gonna be well that it's gonna have a lot of the same things that the one got that's out now. Um, but for the team one, I'm gonna add like a schedule like um the checkoff list is gonna be like homework, chores, did you take some tasks yourself to mental, like stuff like that. Of course they're gonna have a journal or diary because I feel like that's what you need it the most. Um it's gonna have of course a lot of inspirational quotes, way more than I put in the one that we got now. Uh, I'm gonna have like a menstrual cycle tracker. So it's gonna be a lot. Like, um, so I do want to start working on that now, and I want to get it. I want to get it out by January because I hate that I wasn't able to get it back. I, w I hate that I wasn't able to get it out for the new year, but it did just like dawn on me. Like I should do something for it. cause like when my little sister was looking at, it, she was just like, you know, I like it, but it just it it wasn't it wasn't. I don't know how to explain it. It wasn't teen savvy. It wasn't, you know, like for them. So I do want to, that's my next one. And then I told y'all I do want to do something with the content planner, th with the content, digital stuff or whatever. So yeah, I got a lot in store for 2024. Another thing I want to work on is my, um, just my content period. Like I was telling y'all that I'm kind of like sloppy when it comes to you know, posted content. My videos ain't never like crispy, clear, and woo about the mail. So I do want to focus more on that. Um, and then like my advice to y'all with the little tips that I do have was make sure you have a clear camera. Um, you don't have to have an actual digital camera. You can use your phone. The iPhones work miracles. And I actually heard the 13 and 14 camera is better than the 15 camera. So, you know, make sure you clean your screen. Um, and then... Post what you want to post. That's the main thing I said. I think at some point, everybody just start posting what they think is trending right now or what they think people want to watch right now instead of just posting whatever you want to post. Because once you start posting for other people, it's, it's never going to work out. When you start posting stuff that you want to post and you're not worrying about the likes or the shares or the views, it's just genuinely, this is what I want to post. Eventually, everything will come with it. The money, the cost, the fame, all of that's going to come with it. So yeah, that's my little rant for right now. Let me give Charlie his bath so he could be drying while I'm doing my laundry and cleaning. Oh, and I also have my little baby Mayana coming over to take inventory pictures for me. Um, if y'all don't know Mayana, that's Yana's oldest daughter. Um, so she's coming over this afternoon because I got some new inventory that I've been sitting on for literally like um, maybe two to three weeks. I don't know for a minute so she's gonna come over take those pictures for me and then yeah we just gonna do what we need to do come on Charlie okay why you got him in your bed come on Charlie <sighs> don't give me a hard time Charlie it's not that bad it's not that bad. See? It's not that bad. I don't know what can you be in here doing to you. Okay, I need a cup or something. Stop! You have soap poisoning or something.
stressing me out. Anyways, what's y'all plans for New Year's? For New Year's Eve, I have absolutely no plans. I really want to stay at home, but I think my mama is going to make me come to her house. I mentioned like I mentioned like I was standing in the bed um, on New Year's Eve, and she was like, "No, you're not." So I probably go to her house, you know, probably make something to eat, you know, have a drink or two, and that's about it. I really have no desire to club for New Year's. Um, it's just not on the vision board. <laughs> but no, seriously, I think I'm just gonna stay in, whether it's my house or my mom's house. And just, you know, have a chill night. Focus on what I want 2024 to be about. So, yeah, let me know what y'all had planned for New Year's. I think this vlog is going to go up after New Year's. So let me know what y'all ended up doing. And, yeah. fuzzy pants they come in two colors charlie just won't move and then the bitches is weird oh i should have asked your mama is it okay for you to wear this shirt bitches is weird <laughs> anyway y'all we about to go ahead and shoot and if you're interested y'all already know the link is down below okay good morning y'all today is saturday and i promised kaylee i was gonna take her to target to spend the rest of her gift card and to Starbucks because she got a gift card there too. So we're up getting dressed. And y'all, I'm about to film a, um, a get ready with me on TikTok. And I'm pissing Kaylee off because she ready to go. She'll be okay though. I keep telling her I'm trying to get in my TikTok bag. So, but it's not going to take me long. It's going to be really quick. Because I want a really simple, chill outfit. I just want to, you know, get some content. But she ain't she ain't really for that today. But she finna be mad because I'm doing a, um, spend a day with me anyway. So, I'm finna be recording all day. And I got to record on YouTube and on TikTok. She finna be pissed. <laughs> But I mean, like, but I mean, but I mean, what's the rush? You ain't got nowhere to go, nothing to do. You don't have to be <laughs> poor Charlie. She taking her anger out on Charlie. I just hear her steady yelling, get off of me. I play on my dog, girl. Okay, but it's only going to take me 10 minutes from here. Okay, so y'all, I am dressed and we're about to 
leave out. I just got on this vest from Pretty Lil Boss. It's a maxi vest. Um, some all black under some leggings and a leotard. And then I got this from this plaid shirt from Fashion Nova some years ago. Kay not really feeling this or whatever. Come on, let's go. I should have bought you something so you can write down your goals too. No. You need to. I feel doing. How big, how big do you think this gonna be? Mom. Huh? Okay, so y'all, we just made it to Target. Say hi. Okay, so you back and phone me? You back and phone me? Anyway, y'all, so we just made it to Target. And of course, mom got Kaylee a Target for Christmas. I mean, she got Kaylee a gift card, a Target gift card for Christmas. And guess who lost their gift card? Make some noise. <laughs> so we're at customer. We're at customer service trying to see if there's a way that they can get her a new gift card since I have the receipt. I know they said I'll have to call a number and they will ship me a gift card, but since we're here, we're trying to see if it's a way that we can, you know. Yeah, how much y'all think my mama would be if I spent her money? Okay, so we just left out of I'm Publix. Spending. We just left out of Publix to get um, some food to cook tonight oh. while I finish cleaning and getting the house together for New Year. And I want to tell my guys. What you get? Uh, guys, I got like some sticky rice and um. She went in the international aisle per usual. Yeah. Okay. So y'all know I'm trying to be a TikToker, right? So y'all, I'm getting too invested in this. Let me show y'all this. Hold on. I know I'm sexy. Let me show y'all this video. I just died sending this to my friend. Cause why the fuck is my phone in the washing machine? And then I go back in to get it out. <laughs> oh my God, but my, my, my daily vlog finna be raw. I don't care. I do not care. No. It be so funny seeing them talk about, especially the men. They be going on the man. I ain't gonna lie, and I hate I hate to be the one that said, but I don't think I can date a content creator. Cause what you mean? What you mean? Like, yeah, it was this one video and it's the boy and he got some fire content, like content raw. But like he pulled up to McDonald's drive through, got the tripod sitting outside the car while he pulling Content go crazy though. They went on this man so hard in the comments. Like, I can't, I can't date nobody. Like, like I, I don't know. Like women, I laugh at y'all, but you know, you, you're just a girl. But when it comes to my man, and my man gotta set the trap hard up before he, I can't do it. But anyway, I'm about to make some um, what do you call lamb chops? Some roasted potatoes and some asparagus. I would record me making it, but the recipe that I'm using is Kirk and Rashida Restaurant. It's on YouTube. Just Google. I mean, just go on YouTube and search Kirk and Rashida lamb chops. Best lamb chops I've ever had in my life. Like they got it. They got it. I ain't even gonna hold y'all. They got it for the um lamb chop recipe. So if y'all want to make y'all some fire lamb chops, go to their recipe. Um, but I'm still getting my house together. I think I got one more load of laundry to do, but I have like seven loads to freaking fold, but I'm gonna get it done. I'm gonna get it out the way. 
Um, while the laundry is still going, I'm about to cook. Uh, oh, excuse. Oh, that was so. I'm just a girl. Excuse me, y'all. But anyway, I'm about to. I gotta get dinner started because it's six o'clock. I need to post my new inventory that's dropping today at seven o'clock. I need to post a video because I need to get ready with me, even though my outfit was trash. I don't care. It was a comfortable outfit because we was out running errands. So, whatever. But I'm posting that because content is content, right? I guess. Uh, what else I got to do? I need to start working on that other digital planner I was telling y'all about yesterday. And I think that's it. But that's that's really a lot. I really have a lot to do. And then tomorrow is New Year's Eve. So, yeah. But I'm not going to my mom's house until I'm done with everything at home. My little sister stayed texting me, asking me why I'm not coming over today. Because, baby, I'm trying to get my life together. I'm trying to get my life together for 2024. What are you doing? She ain't doing nothing, though, because she, um, she on break. She don't go back to school for another two weeks, though. She's not doing anything. Bruh, my mom finna treat me. She gave me a package to send back. She gave me a package to send back and I did not send it. And the post office is closed, of course, tomorrow. Cause it's Sunday, of course, Monday, because it's a holiday. I'm scared to text her back and tell her, no. She's she gonna go off. What should I say? 2024, I'm gonna stop lying, so let me just say no. Tuesday for sure. I just want to throw my phone out because I know she finna just. Kia, why would you? I hate when I send a risky message and I just want to throw my phone. I just I should have just powered it off. That's what I should have do. And then I don't know. I'm just not gonna look at my phone when she texts back. But anyway, y'all, I got a lot to do, so let me start on dinner. And I'm actually finna bring my computer down here so while dinner is cooking, I could be posting. Okay, so y'all, I just thought about this really, really quick. Um, hold on. I just thought about this really, really quick. Okay, so I told, I just showed y'all the video, and I sent it to my friends, and they was like, here, yeah, like, be fucking for real. Like, they sent out the laughing emojis or whatever. And it made me think about this tweet that Kayla made. So she, so I don't know if y'all know the girl, Christy Scott. Let me show y'all her page, see if y'all know her. Okay, so I don't know if y'all know her. Her name, Christy Sarah on Instagram. Um... This her page. She basically do shit. She basically do stuff like this. Let me show y'all. And then her husband always come out the blue and just get the screaming in. Like, like she, but she always make videos like that. And Kayla reposted it and was like, um. Kelly reposted and was like, imagine if she read the quotes when she was just starting out. An early reminder for next year to do what you enjoy. Some may hate it. Thousands, millions may love it. This lady got 6.1 million followers on Instagram right now. And she just be doing like silly stuff like um, she test out heels by doing cartwheels in them. And her husband just always screaming and laughing at in the background. Like it just be like funny stuff like some people find it funny some people say it's cringy some people be like i don't get it you got probably a hundred thousand people that be like oh i can never and watch bell this lady is building her second dream home from the ground up this lady have millions of followers millions of dollars thousands of brand deals like she she do brand deals for like the biggest companies off doing cartwheels and heels and i'm sure you know when people first in they like you know people just doing anything if that's what you want to do baby you got to do it if that's what you want to do, you have to do it. Like, I feel like at the end of the day, people going to talk regardless. So, if that's what you want to do, do it. You don't know what it could bring. You could, you don't know what doors it can open. So, you know, at 2024, we're not worried about what nobody's saying. We're doing whatever we want to do. So, if I want to close my phone up in a washing machine, that's what I'm going to do. Now, 
I do think it's cringy. I'm not gonna lie. But in the end, I love how my videos been coming out when I be doing stuff like that. I love the, you know, it just be like a movie. It seems like you in a movie. Like, that's how I'm looking at it. Like, because in a movie, y'all don't think they put the cameras in washing machines. Baby, I'm a producer over here. Uh, executive, I'm an actress. I'm everything that comes in it, okay? So, 2024, make sure y'all doing whatever the fuck y'all want to do, okay? What's up, y'all? Come spend a day with me and my baby. We started the day off at Starbucks, and I know we're supposed to be boycotting, but my baby had a gift card, and she was determined to spend it. But anyway, this is her telling them that they made her drink wrong, so fix it, please. And then this is me working on my digital planner. I started working on my 2024 vision board where I just wrote down a few goals and talked about what I want to happen in 2024. This year we planning and manifesting everything. And then we went to Target and this is my daughter telling me why she buy her something. Yes, Christmas was less than a week ago. Girl, bye. But anyway, I love the fact that Ulta and Target collab because this is my favorite section of the store, of course. And then this is me trying to see if I want to spend my mama's savings or not. But we headed to Sephora and then went to Publix. And y'all, they had the viral dumplings. Do y'all know how long we've been looking for those? Then we got some fruit and some old food to cook for tonight. And then y'all, we headed home and I changed it to something more comfortable so I can finish my laundry and do my chores around the house. I had so much to do tonight. I had to edit, work on my website, cook, clean, all of that, getting ready for 2024. So I went on here and got my night started and I cooked dinner, I made lamb chops. Now I sear mine on both sides and then I put it in the oven on 350 for about 10 minutes. And y'all, this make my lamb chops come out so tender and juicy. So I went on here and poured me some wine, made my plate, and of course I made Kaylee plate, but I made it off camera. And I chilled the rest of the night. I sat down, ate my food, and watched me some Netflix. How y'all day went? Yeah, one thing about it, it is two o'clock in the morning. I've been staying up way, way, way past my bedtime. And I hate that because I know when I get my sleep schedule get off track, it be so hard for me to get back on track so i need to start back getting it together especially with kaylee too because she finna start back school so she needs to start back going to sleep at a decent time but y'all one thing about me i'm a random person so i always try to do like random acts of kindness or whatever and I don't know I just and <sighs> I just try to do random acts of kindness and like today this girl wrote me well I um dropped my new inventory today and I dropped my new inventory today and she tweeted me and she was just like um Dang, I wish I would've waited till today already, but I bought something last week. Like, baby, I spent my money last week. So I went to her page, and I see she's just like always supporting me. She watched my videos. Like, she just, like, she's a supporter, and I love that. And I always try to show that I'm truly grateful for the support I receive. So I just, my bro, I'm like, well, you know, what you want is sis. And she sent me what she wanted, and I'm like, all right, it's on the house. I'm going to send it to you. And I love doing stuff like that because I know it's one thing to just keep saying, like, I love y'all for supporting me and we're back to but, like, to actually show actions. And I wish I was able to, you know, bless every single person that support me, but I just randomly do it. Like, um, like sometime last month, it was a girl that was just like, she want to start a business, um... But she don't know where to start. And, you know, I do get a lot of DMs like that. And, like, it's not just black and white. And I literally am still figuring that out, too. But she was just like, you know, she keep running into, like, um, she keep running into, like, you know, shitty vendors or whatever. And I get it. A lot of people be saying, like, they sell their vendors. Because me, too. I didn't been through so many shitty vendors where I didn't spend so much money. And they send me some stuff that, like... You don't even want to sell because you don't even want that attached to your name. So I've been there. But I just was like, look, these are the vendors that I use. Blah, 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 blah. Like, I gave some out on a, um, on a TikTok, too. Because I just feel like, you know, it is what it is. Like, 
Of course, I I, I understand both sides. I understand the girls who sell their vendors. Because, like, I worked hard for this. Like, and you just want me to give it up. Like, you know, people do want to take the easy route out. But it just genuinely do be some people that just need that extra help, that, like, extra helping hand. And if I can be that one, I would most definitely love to be that one. But... No, y'all don't be coming on all my pictures. Somebody send me some free shit. Cause how me and Kaylee gonna eat? How we gonna pay these bills? But like, I do love doing random acts of kindness, and I hope whoever I do it to pay back and help someone else if they can. Like, you just never know who day you may make. You never know who needed that kindness for the day. Like, you don't even know what people going through. Whatever the case may be. So I always just randomly, and it don't matter if it's big, if it's small, whatever the case may be. I randomly stop somebody like, girl, you are so pretty. Like, and you just, you never know. Like, so I hope that inspires y'all to always be kind. If you can help, help. If you can give back, give back. And you know, your blessings going to come regardless. Regardless if it come now, later. Opening your eyes is a blessing, to be honest. And it's so underrated. And we, you know, always forget that opening your ass is just a true blessing and we always forget that you know we are literally blessed i feel like we complain so much and we want so much and we see this and we want more and more and more never satisfied but when you really look at it like you could be anywhere in the world you got a roof over your head you ate your kids ate whatever the case may be and they probably don't be the best or what you consider to be the best because it probably don't be the best or what you consider to be the best, but baby, it's something. You have to learn to be grateful for, you know, what you do have. You have to learn to be grateful for the people you have around you. You got to be able to know when, you know, like, and, you know, stop. Like, I know they say, you know, reach for the world, reach for this, you want this, but it's okay to just be like, I'm grateful for what I got. I'm thankful for what I got. And I feel like so many times we all lose sight of that. That sometimes you just be having to take a second, calm down, and just be grateful. And be thankful. Oh, is my titty out? And just be thankful for what God gave you. Be thankful that you're still alive. And, you know, but I'm about to go to sleep. Because, like I said, it's 2 o'clock in the morning. I just wanted to talk to y'all about that. And, you know, we're going into 2024. And with my planner, I talk so much about mental. So we most definitely get our mental together. We most definitely become a mentally and emotionally elevated in so many ways, even if that's helping the next person. Let's get it together, boo-boo. What's up, y'all? And happy New Year's Eve today. Can I turn it off real quick? A few more hours until the new year. And I don't know about y'all. But I'm ready. I'm ready for the new year. I'm ready to go in strong. I'm ready to for a fresh new start. I am a red tea, hon tea. I got my kids with me. Um, I'm about to go to my mama's house. She cooking. We're about to drink some champagne. And we chilling tonight. I am working on... Um, well, I did my goals. I wrote my goals down yesterday. But I still want to add a few more things. And I also want to um, do a digital vision board. So I'm going to do that tonight. And I'm just chilling tonight. Like, I wasn't feeling no club. I wasn't feeling partying or doing none of that. So we chilling. We making it count. Okay? Okay. Alexa, pause. Yeah. What's up, y'all? I am home. I literally just walked through the door. It's 1.26 p. I mean, <laughs> a.m. Um, I literally just walked through the door. It was real chill at Mama's house. We had some champagne. Mama had ended up buying us some champagne and raving. Y'all know raving in college, so she had hard liquor. She don't know what champagne is. Um, But like I said, it was real chill. We end, I mean, I ended up making this digital vision board. Let me show y'all. It is so cute. I ended up making this digital vision board. 
I'm absolutely in love with it. I made it my wallpaper on my phone, my iPad, and my computer. So every time I wake up, every moment throughout my day, I'm absolutely looking at my goals and looking at my visions. So I feel like that's one thing I want y'all to do. I know I feel like I think I'm y'all teacher or y'all feel like I'm in charge. <laughs> but no, like we doing this together. So that's y'all first homework assignment. Yeah, I'm tipsy. I'm tipsy off champagne because I'm a fucking lady. <laughs> but no, y'all assignments is to make sure y'all fill out y'all 2024 vision board on the planner. And I, well, y'all don't have to do this. I just think this is just so cute. And then I will also post mine in case y'all want to use mine because my shit raw. Luxury, love, workout, flat, like... Is everything a girl ever wanted? Is everything that I could dream of? <laughs> so anyway, I will tune in with y'all tomorrow. Good morning, y'all. Today is January second. Today is like the first day of the new year. <laughs> Cause yesterday didn't count. Yesterday we were still recovering from New Year's Eve, and then you know I just chilled yesterday. I wanted to you know take my first day to chill, but today. Y'all, I didn't go to sleep until like 4 o'clock in the morning, but I still woke up at 9 a.m. I made Kaylee get up. She's in there doing her homework. Took Charlie out, made breakfast. Now I'm about to fold all of my laundry. Um, I know the clothes supposed to be clean before the new year come in. They was clean. They ain't said they had to be folded, though. So I'm about to fold my laundry and chill. Yesterday, we had our black eyed peas. We had our green cabbage for wealth. Like, we did, baby, we did everything under the sun. We ain't got time for no flimsy years, okay? Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog out so I can post it and get it to y'all today. Yeah, two videos in two days. Don't play with your girl. I'm going out in this year. Get up, y'all, and get on your Zoom. Happy New Year. I've been my phone. I got options. I don't wanna tell you to drop me, but I don't wanna play your